So yes, we finally have an asteroid inside the game that you can actually land on. And no, this is not a custom pack. It is part of the new 1.5.10 update. So let's go and have a look at what's new. Starting off with this asteroid, it's roughly 200 meters wide and it's further away from the moon. Here are all the other numbers if you want. On the asteroid, there are two challenges that you complete, but ooh, what are these new challenges? Well, there's currently 23 and they're fairly similar to achievements, but are ranked with different difficulties. Easy, medium, hard, and extreme. Kind of like the illustrations here as well. Also, hence the name challenge, there aren't any cheats allowed. They also have them in the moon as well, so let's just complete one of them. Oh, and um, would you look at that, rocks are in the game. Although they don't actually react since the lag would be unbearable, they are still a very nice new addition to the game. Now, we've got a few other bits to look at outside of the world and on the homepage. And also, everywhere else, there are button icons. I'm currently on the side on these, but they do have consistent designs throughout, which is good. Now, when we just can't stop getting enough new parts, guess what? We've got another one. This time, it is rounded nose cones. And as you can see here, it's an excellent idea, and it will definitely make for some really good builds in the future. And oh my goodness, would you look at that? There are five different difficulty levels which we have seen in the Steam beta, and it was a highly requested feature for mobile. And if you want to go for an extra challenge, you can select challenge mode, turn off quick saves, and then select hard mode. Well, I'll leave you to go and try that.